Hello everyone, this is Maria. Today we will continue our tutorial, tutorial 22. So today's tutorial is about how to set the backlight adjustment in the display. Actually, there are two ways. Uh, the first one is the display will automatically adjust the backlight. Mm, okay, so it means when you not touch the display for some minutes, the display will will be into the backlight mode, and then when you touch, uh, and retouch again, the display will be back to the normal mode. Okay, so this is uh, this is the um, method one, and the method two is uh, you can adjust the backlight uh, parameters in the display directly. Okay, so here this is the method one. So firstly, you should um, set the parameters in the CFG. Five five location. Five point two is about the touch panel backlight standby control. One is open, zero is closed. So here, uh, you should select open. And then backlight standby configuration, uh, 0C, 0D, and 0E, you should uh, set the parameters. So first, normal operation and startup brightness. Okay, this is the utmost. And this is a standby brightness. So it means when you not touch the display, and the display will be into backlight uh, mode. So what's the brightness you want to set for this mode? You can set, okay? And 0E is for the week after, after standby. Okay, this is the time setting. And here I, <coughs> I list uh, the calculation formula. Okay, you can have a better understanding. So corresponding to above explanation here, you can see five location. Uh, before I write uh, 3, 9, and here, this is the location for backlight standby configuration. Uh, I'm not sure if this is open open backlight, but if not, you can adjust it by your side, okay? So now, uh, do you have a better understanding for how to set the backlight um, in the display automatically? If you have uh, have the idea, and then we can we can go to the step two. Okay. Step two is adjust the backlight in the display directly. So you should use the module. One is the display control module is the slide display, and the other is touch control module is drag adjustment. You you should be quite familiar with the two modules. I think the most important thing is that. For the backlight um, adjustment, the it has the system variable address. So here you can see this is 82. 82 is for the LED configuration. Here you can see still D3, D2, and also others. Uh, okay, so let's try it. This is the project that here, this is about the backlight. So this is the slide display, and this is the drag adjustment. So in the slide display, uh, the VP address is 0082. 0, 82, 0, 0, okay. Initial value and terminal, because uh, because the utmost is 64, so uh, I could only set the utmost value is 100, okay? And terminal value, slide mode, you can, you can set it by your side. Slide mode, horizontal or vertical, because this is horizontal, I set horizontal. And I confirm, you need, uh, for the slide display, you need an icon, okay? and. Uh, I confirm. 
Uh, I use this one. Also for this icon, I set the filter to have a better clear icon, uh, more beautiful in the display. The most importantly is this part, variable type. Variable type is not by word, it's by high byte. Okay, and the initial value is the um, backlight, uh, backlight um, bright list at the initial stage. So here I set 100. Okay, do you have a better understanding here? So the most importantly is the variable type is high byte. And here, this is the drag adjustment. Uh, also, same WP address, 82. Data return mode, high byte. Okay, drag mode, horizontal. Start value, terminated value. Okay, this is the scope. Okay, so now uh, let's, let's say it in the display, okay? So let's jump to the backlight page. Okay. <clears throat> Do you have a better uh, understanding for the backlight in the screen? Actually, it's, um, it's with no standby, okay. Okay, you can see it. Okay, this is how it works in the display if you set uh, the model in the display, okay? so. Here's tutorial is over. Bye-bye.